Hello everyone, my name is John Fisher. I'm the Director of Product Development for the lightweight brands for Jayco, which includes the White Hawk, Jayfeather, and Jayfeather Micro. Today we're doing some video shoots and we're excited to show you the new 2022 enhancements for our brands. We're standing in the Jayfeather, it's one of our absolute top sellers, the 27 BHB, that's been out a few model years. Uh, so we're gonna take some time and, and go through the interior and exterior and show you some of the new things. Before we get started, I do want to talk to you a little bit about some of the new models that are coming out for 2022. We feel like we have a very solid lineup overall across the board, but we are adding four new models. So there's going to be some smaller eight wide double axle uh, trailers. And one of them is going to be a 20 MBH which is going to be a, a small non-slide Murphy bed model uh, with, with a double over double bunkhouse. Uh, we're going to have a 21 MML, which is also, uh, again, double, uh, double axle, eight wide, but it's a more of a rear bath type couples coach. We, we know it's going to be a super good seller. And that'll be, again, be followed up with a 22 BH, which is a more of a shallow slide It'll be more of a weight sensitive. All three will be more weight sensitive. Uh, but again, it's gonna have a front queen bed with a double, double, double over double bunk as well. So we're excited about these three new models. They'll be coming out in the coming months. And then we also are gonna be doing a revision on the 27 RL floor plan, which we've had out in the lineup for three, four, five years. Uh, we've got a new rear living coming out, which is called a 26 RL. Uh, we just feel like we freshened that floor plan up and we're excited to get it out to you guys. So before uh, we get started in some of the things that we did too, I want to just talk about interiors overall. Uh, I want to give a shout out to Stacy Stewart and her design team. Uh, she's been with Jayco for well over 20 years and has done a great job for the company. But she spearheads our design and really, really pays attention to what's going on out there in, in the housing trends. So we feel like a lot of our new interiors over the past number of years are really staying along those trends and we're excited to introduce our 2022 interiors which we we feel are the best overall uh to date with with jayco um, so one thing that we're gonna that you're seeing in this 27 bhb is the modern farmhouse this decor was introduced about three or four model years ago and has just been awesome everybody's kind of loved that modern farmhouse but Jayco also started in that same time frame offering another decor. So unlike our competition where you go in and it's the same interior look, but you can pick a different fabric, we give you different uh, decor wood choices. So uh, we were introduced last year in Jayfeather and then with the debut of Jayfeather Micro, we came out with vintage wash gray. So that's been uh, in the last year done very well. We're gonna carry both of these decors over for 2022. So you'll have the modern farmhouse, you'll have the vintage wash gray. That will be available in not only Jayfeather, but Jayfeather Micro and White Hawk. Okay, now something to bear in mind when you pick a decor, uh, whether it be modern farmhouse or, modern, or vintage wash gray, is that your bedroom is always gonna be bourbon chocolate. So it's gonna have that darker access, darker accent tone. And while you're in the 27 BHB, you've got a nice walk around queen bed. You've got wards on both sides with removable shelves. And one thing you'll notice back here, we've got cubbies built in and that, that you'll see that in White Hawk in a lot of our floor plans. There's also a, a 110 outlet back there and that will fit most CPAP machines, uh, glasses, books. So you got a nice storage act back there. You got a little light right here that will actually give you some blue accent light back in that cubby. So if you want to have a little night light, then we got USBs on both sides, and obviously your bed struts up. And you know, one thing you'll always notice, you know, we talk about the construction features in a Jayco, and you know, you're you're only gonna see plywood, plywood bed bases, plywood. Uh, dinette bases, plywood bunk bases, underneath our shower platforms or tub platforms, it's all plywood. So it's always about quality and construction here at Jayco. And then lastly, one cool thing with this is just it's just got a really nice size pocket door. 
So it opens the bedroom up, but you also have your privacy at night if you need it. Okay, so again, bourbon chocolate in the bedroom. Your dinette area is always gonna be bourbon chocolate. You'll see we've got a nice booth dinette in here. Um, we've got the trifold sofa, which will make out into a nice sleeping area if you have extra campers. And then again, going back to decors, you've got a bourbon chocolate entertainment center. So if there is an entertainment center in a White Hawk or a J Feather or a Micro, it's gonna be bourbon chocolate. And then if you have bunks, you'll also see that accent wood bourbon chocolate. Now again, whether it is modern farmhouse or vintage wash, you're always gonna have a modern farmhouse bathroom. So nice layout with the bathroom, medicine cabinet, we've got storage, towels over here, you got some hook rack or uh, some, some uh, towel hooks. It's got a 40 inch shower tub in it. And the nice thing with me being 6'1", I can stand in here and got plenty of space to take a shower. And one thing that consumers love is we still offer the outside camp kitchen in a 27 BHB, but we've got an exterior door on the, on the camp side that allows you to come in without traipsing through the entire coach. So consumers have really, really liked that as well. So then again, getting back to the, uh, the decors. So again, this area right here will be your modern farmhouse. And if you would have a vintage wash gray interior, it would basically replace this area. So again, you know, hats off to Stacy Stewart and her design team. They've done a wonderful job. Going into 2022, we just made some, some slight tweaks to the product, but I feel like I said that our interiors are the best they've ever been. Stacy came in and we did all new vinyl flooring throughout, which it's got that wood plank look which consumers really like. But one thing you'll notice in all of the lightweight brands with Jayco, we have no carpet. So even in the slide out, we put vinyl. Um, some other things that we've done, we've got all new countertops throughout. So we stayed white, we stayed bright, but it's a new design in our countertop, has that marbleized look. One thing I thought that was really cool that Stacy did is we've got a new back, decorative backsplash and it, it's a subway tile bright white look last year we had more of a uh it was a darker back backsplash more kind of accented and matched the the bourbon chocolate but i really like what stacy did here because it, it along with all the led lighting that we put in the roofs in all the different areas it really makes the coach bright uh light and bright and then we got just enough you know subtle places with the bourbon chocolate to give it some good uh, accent. Another thing that we did is throughout, we have all new black fixtures. So plumbing fixtures in the bathroom, in the kitchen, all, all along your, uh, your cabinet pulls. So anywhere where we have any kind of a, a hard fixture, it's going to be black. Our, our lighting fixtures are black. So, um, that was another nice thing she did. And then we have all new decorative wall board to just kind of, again, light and bright and really accents the overall decor. Another cool feature in the 27 BHB is with our e-center, we've got 40 inch LED TV in this model. And a cool thing is you got a little pull string there and we've got exterior storage behind, which consumers really like. They say they'll keep their guns and their cash back there, but they really like that feature. But just the overall storage that we have, you know, in the kitchen area, the entertainment center area, couple drawers here got a little bit of storage here but you know under the pots and pans drawer nice little flip up countertop three deep drawers here and then you've obviously got a nice pantry and overhead space here overhead space here so that's another really cool thing that the 27 bhb offers as well as the bunks this has kind of been a, a cool jaco feature where the bottom bunk is hinged and so you can go up lock it into place and we put a cargo net so you can put bikes you can put grills while you're transporting to and from the campsite you got a really cool place to store a lot of stuff that you're taking back and forth and as you'll see if uh ryan pop over here there's again want to show you that plywood base so on our bunks at jaco where a lot of the competition when you have single bunks they're rated at 150 pounds. Ours are rated at 300 pounds. And with a double over double bunk like we have, most of the competitions at a 300 pound rating 
we're at a 600 pound rating. So those are some of the things that we did on the interiors of the, of the uh, J Feather brand and particularly this 27 BHB. Now we're gonna to wanna to go outside and we'll show you some of the cool things we did on the exterior. Now we're on the exterior of the 2022 J Feather model, the 27 BHB. Just wanna go through a uh, few of the exterior enhancements for 2022. Uh, one thing you'll notice is that over the last three to four years, we've had a linear graphics package on the J Feather brand. Uh, we were one of the first to introduce it uh, years ago and it's been, went over well with, uh, a lot of the uh, retail public. Uh, so we just wanted to enhance that linear look this year uh, and stay with the monochromatic graphics color, which is your chromes and your whites and grays and silvers, blacks. The nice thing about the monochromatic uh, coloring is that it will look good with any tow vehicle. Uh, so we've had, of the 2022 product that has landed, we've had many consumers and uh, dealers and even people within Jayco that have said it's the best looking J Feather they've seen ever. So we're really excited uh, about the exterior look, the curb appeal of the product, because if it looks good on the outside and you got the right floor plans, it's going to bring you inside and ultimately get the sale. Um, one other thing we did to enhance the exterior look is we've got sidewinder aluminum rims, and that's not only on J Feather, it's on the J Feather Micro, White Hawk, and I believe most of the J uh, Feather towables. So the new uh, aluminum rims look really good. Uh, one thing that we did when we debuted the J Feather Micro is knowing that was an off-road camper, we, we know fresh water capacity is important. So we debuted that brand with 55 gallon fresh water capacity. And for 2022, we have um, increased on both the White Hawk and all J Feather models to 55 gallons. So I know consumers are always gonna like the fact that they have the capacity for more fresh water. Uh, we've added an exterior TV bracket to complement the TV hookups. So if you are out under the awning, camping and making memories, you can hook up a 24, 32 inch TV and, and have a TV going if a big game's on or you wanna watch a movie. Um, then one thing that, that Jayco was really excited about is we recently introduced the J port system, which is a two inch receiver on the camp side underneath the awning that will house a Blackstone griddle. So on the lightweight models with Jayco, um, every unit has the J port system, which includes the two inch receiver. It includes an, a, an arm bracket that will house a table that actually will house the Blackstone griddle. So that is, that is on every one of the Jayco lightweights um, and, it, and the, black, the 17 inch Blackstone griddle is actually standard on the J Feather micro models and on all J Feather and White Hawk models that have an outside camp kitchen. If it does not have an outside camp kitchen, then you can get a 17 inch Blackstone griddle option or you can buy it aftermarket. But it's, uh, it's something that we're really excited about. And I know a lot of the micro models that are out there the retail uh, public is buzzing about having the capability to cook things on the griddle, which is a huge buzz across the U.S. A um, couple other things that we did, we've got a 14,500 BTU uh, Furion AC, where a lot of the competition has 13,500 BTUs. So you've got that increased cooling capacity as well as they're quieter and, and more efficient. So we're excited to introduce that to the lightweight brands. It's not only on the J Feather, but it's on the J Feather Micro and the White Hawk. And um, if, if the model uh, where you can option a second AC on Feather or White Hawk, that second AC will also be that Furion 14,500 BTU AC. So you have the capability on some models of having 29,000 BTU. Um, which will really uh, cool your unit nicely. A uh, couple other things, um, going into 2022, we had a shark fin uh, TV antenna the past three, four years. We've replaced that now with an WineGuard Air 360, which through our testing at the Jayco R&D facility, it will improve TV and radio reception. So we're excited uh, with more and more campers going off-road and uh, we just, we like that capability of having better TV and radio uh, reception, and even at the campground as well. Um, then lastly, we changed our roof material. For years, we've used a Dicor Diflex 2 
which is a TPO, TPO membrane based product. And our supplier just updated to a Gen 3 that uh, Jayco has gone to across the board on all of our towables. Nice thing about it is it provides 20% more puncture and tear resistance and has an industry leading 20 year warranty. So those are a lot of the uh, enhancements, both interior and exterior, as well as the new models for Jayfeather. We absolutely value the continued support and growth on the brand and appreciate um, all the positive feedback that we've gotten. Um, if you wanna see the new enhancements, 2022 enhancements, or the new models that we talked about, everything is on the website that was just kicked off under www.jaco.com. Thank you for your time today.